Hi everyone, I'm Heidi Ducato and I have the opportunity to speak with Jim Miller today, a syndicated columnist. And as we all know, cyber crimes are definitely on the uptick and especially with seniors. Tell us a little bit about that. So Heidi, the, the pandemic made this problem a whole lot worse when everyone was staying home, living their lives online. It became a prime opportunity for cyber criminals. And some things you can do to protect yourself. The first thing is to strengthen your passwords. A strong password should contain at least seven characters, including some numbers and some special characters like a dollar sign or an asterisk. Also want to remind seniors to make sure you lock your smartphone. About 25% of Americans don't do that. And the problem is, is if your smartphone gets stolen, your identity and your financial information can get stolen too. That makes a big difference, just having that little additional bit of security. And I know with that, with cyber crimes and things of that nature, you also run into identity theft. Tell us a little bit about that piece. So identity theft is a big issue. Hackers will sometimes send you emails and text messages pretending to be somebody that they're not. And they do this in order to convince you to share your valuable information with them. So if you receive a message from an unknown sender that seems a little bit off or a little bit strange, don't respond and don't click on anything. Either just ignore the message or delete it. Perfect. That's the easiest way to take care of it. <laughs> and I know um, in addition to what you were just saying, tell us a little bit about tips and tricks, costs, things like that that can help people with this. So I think it's a good idea to check with your internet provider to see if they have, have any extra tools. Uh, if you're a Cox customer, for example, they provide many online security features that you can access at cox.com. And when you get there, search the word security. Perfect. Thank you so much for your time. We appreciate it. Definitely check out more information regarding Cox Communications.